Hey, if you're looking for a free compliant way to capture lead information on your personal branded web page, well, we'll go over that today. All right, so if you guys want something like, like this um, here on your page or the, on the screen, well, I'll show you exactly the process that your clients would go through so that you can get one of these and see if this matches for your practice. Okay, so I'm going to refresh this so that you'll see from the very beginning what it looks like. So you can send your client this link up here. And in the link above, uh, it'll have this. It'll say Matthew Raguto, your name, not Matthew Raguto, not my name. Welcomes you for an electronic signature on a SOA form. You can click here. I'm not a robot. That's all is required. And it does give the disclaimer here that CMS requires us as agents to document a scope of appointment. So it's a legitimate thing and we click not a robot has our wonderful picture here so long as you, you upload it and also your brand logo so if you have another brand logo you want to put go ahead and upload it to this section here now we're going to click to proceed it does give the little uh, notice here that if it's not your agent so if your client clicks on the wrong link or if it has preloaded someone else for some reason the uh, client will know to X out and try again with that link. So when you click to proceed, it pre-fills all the different um, types of plans you can present in a Medicare meeting, uh, dental vision hearing, hospital indemnities, um, and med subs and Part C and D plans. All the beneficiary will need to do is to put here their first initial, so go M, and then last name, the address and the phone number as well as your signature are also required for the client or the prospect to go ahead and fill out and then you can submit. There we go. So as the client, I would get this confirmation form. This is who the beneficiary is. It would be me and again my phone number pre-populate there as as me and then the signature is my signature that I put into this thing initially and uh, that's what the client gets and this is their documentation and on your side so let's jump into uh, ooh, I think I might have a here on your side as the uh, client or as the agent you would get this and it says dear you Regudo has signed the scope of appointment and discuss that location where um, and information and in the future uh, this information will be captured and sent directly into producer max so that you can have a uh, you know, scope of appointment form all in one location. And I have just recently started doing this. Um, so it'll be very, uh, it's new to me. Uh, hopefully it'll bring value and efficiency to your practice. And especially with 2021 AEP looking like a more uh, online based kind of uh, enrollment environment we kind of want to have all the more efficient and technological tools kind of under our belts. Uh, so it'd be good timing now to practice with this so that your AEP can be your best AEP. All right, we'll see you guys in the next video.